While Curator is a great place from the offensive staff to investigate new type of incidents, for example, this DMC port scan well, from China, oh well, the, you know, there are many, many instances in which the type of incident detected by Curator, you know how to deal with it. You need to re-image a box, get a machine out of the network, uh, send an email to HR, whatever are the actions that you need to perform, the offenses that might not be the best place for it. In fact, I had found a bunch of customers that are using a tool like Resilient. Let me actually go here in the customization setting for performing the workflow operation. I mean, the workflow actions that you have in, in Curator today are not that uh, that flexible. But in here, in Resilient, in fact, uh, what I did is I, I called my friend Charlie Nimi and uh, he actually showed me, he created in minutes uh, this workflow in which, you know, uh, it's called system intrusion and he does the initial triage and then in parallel these two actions and it follows more tasks uh, and then here's a, you go this way or that way depending on some conditions in here, you close the offense and the ticket. So he actually did this very, very quickly and this is the 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 type of environment for performing those and making sure that everybody follows to a standard in the company to a playbook of the actions to be taken so you can report appropriately to it you can be compliant with regulations and you can prove to the auditors that you have uh, done your due diligence in closing rapidly and with the least uh, impact and cost uh, that incident not only I want to make sure that you, you get a couple of points. Number one is that this task can, what, while they can be manual, they can also be, and in many cases they are automatic. Like for example, getting a device out of the network. Well, you don't call anybody to actually do that or logging into any console is very trivial to use the resilient platform to make an API call into whatever tool that is and in fact Resilient has many out-of-the-box integration with many of those tools to perform so, such action. You can easily write also Python script to perform things that are unique to it. But uh, if we go actually to the, uh, Cura uh, the X4 App Exchange and we go here into the apps notice actually that <laughs> the resilient app are kind of a catching up with the curator one and these are all integrations that exist out of the box on resilient there are eight more pages of this you know bunch of things that you don't need to you know write any code but actually use them take them from here and use them with your resilient app so also, another thing that is interesting is that the integration is far more than just throwing an offense into the over the fence on, on to resilient. The integration is more sophisticated than that. Notice that, and it is, it is always the case, or most often the case, that you need as part of a resolution within the, uh, the resilient land of an incident, you need to perform some curator searches. And you can have some predefined searches. The, the person at the other end, who may not even know what curator is, he has some searches that allows him to gather more information, he or her, to gather more information in order to properly decide uh, how to deal with that particular incident. So the searches are important. And notice also that you can find stuff in curator reference sets. You can put stuff and, uh, and delete stuff in curator reference sets. You can close the curator offense as well. So the integration is a, is a truly bidirectional uh, type of thing. So let's actually go back to the uh, to curator and actually take this this particular event and send it to resilient. And again, you can automate this process. I suspect that this is phishing. I actually click in it and then that goes bang and is here into into uh, into resilient with all that particular data that was contained in the offense. From this point, the individual 
in Resilient can proceed to perform all the tasks to actually rapidly close this incident. So if I go here onto the, under the task, you know, I can either check in here, let's say I'm new to this thing, and say, well, interview key individual, what does this is? And here you will have the instruction of, this, of the things that you actually need to do again. This is a manual case, it can be automated as well. And when you're done, you click check, and you can actually you know, do the same here, or, or you know exactly what it is, you can actually click check, and then you, you complete all the different steps, and all this is nicely logged, and there are nice reports that prove to the auditors and to whoever wants to see it, how you actually dealt with this uh, particular uh, incident. Uh, I found this extremely interesting, However, in the channel, I currently stick pretty much close to uh, curator videos, but let me know by kindly posting a comment if you think that it will be useful for you, for me to keep learning more about Resilient and its, it's work with, uh, with curator uh, and, and produce videos on this area, or if you are not interested, then don't put any comment and I will get uh, that feedback as well.